I, I don't ask for a lot out of life, but man, <laughs> if you can give me this, I'll I mean, take you it. really Woo. couldn't ask for much more than no, what we have no, right this now. This is super nice. Muggy meters comfortable mm -hmm. now. Uh, a little bit breezy. But the trade off is, yeah. and you were talking about the commercial break. Oh boy, the pollen count. Mm -hmm. It is off the charts here. Yeah. It is the season, man. Sniffle, sniffle city. Sniffle. Yeah, better <laughs> believe it. Uh, and we just don't have any rain to knock it down, which is good and bad. You know, the farmers here in central Indiana need to get in these fields uh, and get the crops in the ground. So there's going to be a nice stretch run. We don't envision. Uh, really any big rain chances until maybe this weekend here, but here comes the heat average high 71 forecasting 88 on Wednesday. Last time we had 89 in Indianapolis officially back in September of last year in the last 90 degree day back in August uh, 29th. So uh, even if we don't hit either of those numbers, it is going to be well above average, but today one of the best uh, of the uh, week, if not of the year, in my opinion, at least for Indy. Now, west of the city, I know there's some cloud cover, but 71, gusty southeast wind, dew point below 60. 60 degrees is our line of discomfort. So today, overall, a pleasant day, forecasting 80. The average is 71, and look at the big swings we could have in the month of May. 93 is our daily record high. Just two years ago, we had a morning low of 27. 53 was the low this morning. I mentioned the cloud cover. You can see it's approaching Indianapolis here. It eventually will fizzle out, but not before it's going to block the sky here on the western half of the state for the next couple of hours. But it's really, uh, other than that, more of a novelty. We're at 70 even with the clouds in Greencastle, 74 in Shelbyville, and we should easily hit 80 degrees for today, if not a little warmer than that. So uh, going to be a great day after work and school. Balmy, breezy, gust over 30. That's the big complaint today. That's really been the big complaint for uh, seemingly the last two and a half, three months. Uh, here's the forecast highs around the Ohio Valley. Look to the west. So even warmer air yet to come, and that will show up tomorrow. At least 85 in Indy uh, with a more of a southerly wind for tomorrow, and that will be a difference maker. It's going to be more humid. We'll start out near 60. Well, warm quickly, almost at 80 degrees this time tomorrow, and then in the 80s. Muggy meter, yeah, it's going to be the air you can wear tomorrow as well as Wednesday. Later in the week, though, we'll have a, what we call a backdoor cold front, so a front that comes in from the east versus the west-northwest. And you'll see here, again, we're in the green on Tuesday and Wednesday, so that's real sweaty air. And then that drier air starts to punch in from the eastern part of the country and voila, we'll have much more refreshing uh, outdoor time going into Thursday and Friday. Doesn't mean it's going to be necessarily much cooler. Uh, tomorrow, humid 85, pushing 88 on Wednesday, make tire record there Thursday, Friday mainly sunny. Now we have a front coming in, timing still a little uncertain, but it will bring us a chance of some afternoon thunderstorms on Saturday and then we've got Kids Day and a rookie run on Sunday. There will be some showers and thunderstorms around and we'll start to cool down a little bit. Stay with us and we'll update the timing and coverage as we get closer to the weekend.